Good morning, everybody, and welcome to our phase five phonics video. Our learning objective today is to read and write tricky words. Now, if you remember, tricky words are words that we can't sound out. We just have to know them. We just have to be able to read them because if we try and sound them out, they don't make any sense. So I looked. Can you say that? Looked. Now, looked is a tricky one because quite often when you come to write the word looked, you think you can hear a t sound at the end of the word. And that's just because of the way we pronounce the word. So quite often when you come to write this word, you will put the t sound on the end. Again, that's another reason why it's tricky. Looking very carefully at this word, we can see it actually ends with an ed. So whilst we hear the t, it's an ed to look at it when we're reading it and when we come to write it. So one more time, say the word looked. Our next word is called. Can you say that? Called. And then our final word is asked. Can you say that? Asked. Let's have a go then at reading some sentences with this week's tricky words in and some previous tricky words as well. We'll read it a couple of times together and then I want you to have a go at reading them on your own. So first sentence, the dog looked at the phone. Let's do that again. The dog looked at the phone. Second sentence, she called the people over. Let's read it again. She called the people over. And then final sentence, the man asked which way. The man asked which way. So we've got the words looked called and asked in there. So what I would like you to do now is to pause the video and on your own, have a go at reading those sentences again. Once you've done that, restart the video so that we can carry on. Okay, so now we're ready to move on. Grab your exercise books and pencils and copy the word looked as it is on the screen into your books for me. I'll give you a few seconds to do that. If you need to pause the video, if you need longer, then that's fine. Okay, so I'm gonna give you one minute. I'm gonna start the timer now. You've got one minute to write looked as many times as you can. Are you ready? Go. Twenty seconds have gone so far. So halfway through, thirty seconds left. Ten seconds left. OK, and stop. Finish the word that you're writing if you're in the middle of that word. And then very quickly count how many times you've written that word down correctly and jot it down in your books. If you need to pause the video whilst you're doing that, that's fine. Otherwise, I'm going to move on. So next word, called. Again, copy the word called one time in your books for me. If you need to pause the video, if you need a little bit longer, that's fine. If not, we're going to move on. So again, you have one minute to write called as many times as you can. Off you go.
20 seconds gone so far. Thirty seconds gone. Ten seconds left. and stop. Again, if you're partway through writing calls, finish writing it, count how many times you've written it correctly and jot it down into your books. If you need to pause the video whilst you're doing that, that's fine. Otherwise, we're going to move on to the last word, which is asked. So copy the word asked one time into your books for me. If you need a little bit of extra time, Pause the video, otherwise we're going to move on. Oh, I'm just going to wait a sec because um, my time has started. So let's just, just clear that. Okay, one minute back on the timer again. So you're going to write asked as many times as you can in one minute. Off you go. So 20 seconds so far. So halfway through, that's 30 seconds gone. Ten seconds left. And stop. Again, if you're partway through the word, just finish writing it and then count up how many times um, you've written that word correctly as well. And then out of the three, see which word you, that you were the best at. So that would be the word that has the highest score. OK, so moving on, you're now going to have a go at listening to some sentences and then writing them down. So I'm going to dictate. I'm going to say some sentences and you're going to write them down. At the end of each sentence, pause the video so that you can finish writing the sentence before you move on to the second one. So we've got three sentences because we've got three tricky words today. So our first sentence, I'm going to say the sentence first. I want you to listen and then I will say it a second time and then I want you to have a go at writing it down for me. So first sentence, the boy looked at the clouds. OK, so this time I want you to think about writing it down. The boy looked at the clouds. I'm going to say it one more time and then pause the video so that you can finish writing the sentence. The boy looked at the clouds. OK, second sentence, exactly the same as before. I will say it a few times, then you will need to pause the video so that you can write the sentence down before moving on. So second sentence, the girl called her dad. The girl called her dad. The girl called her dad. Dad. Pause the video, finish writing the sentence. And then the last sentence is I asked for a cake. I asked for a cake. I asked 
for a cake. Again, pause the video um, so that you can finish writing the sentence and then restart it again once you've done that. Right, so let's go through all of the words that we have learnt so far. So these are all of the tricky words that we've learnt so far. So we'll read them together and then I want you to have a go at reading them on your own. So we're going to start at the top and we're going to go down the first column and then down the second column. So together, oh, there, people, called, mister, missus, looked, asked so your turn pause the video and read through the words on your own then restart the video so we can move on to the second uh, onto the following slide sorry right then so the next two slides i want you to check i will um swap this on the slides because i've just noticed that i haven't swapped the words over we've still got mr and mrs and in fact um in fact, that slide is completely wrong. So ignore that. Ignore that this part of the video. Stop the video at this point um, and then check your spellings and check your sentences. Um, and then if you go on to the final slide and have a go at playing tricky word tricks where you can read the different tricky words that we've done so far. Well done for today. Keep up the hard work.